for today's voc voc blah, 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 blah. <laughs> for today's vocabulary, number one is hub. Uh, a hub is usually what we refer to as kind of like the, the the main place or the center of activity where all of the information and action is happening. Uh, sometimes we say, for example, Singapore is uh, one of the big financial hubs of Asia. Hong Kong is a financial hub of Asia, meaning that it's the uh, the center of activity for uh, finance. Number two, flag. Uh, is basically to uh, mark something for attention, uh, which I'm sure you guys know whenever you see an email, and if it's like important some, in some way, you flag that email, right? Number three, thorny. Uh, thorny refers to uh, a really <laughs> difficult situation. And uh, if you imagine like, um, you know, uh, some plants with thorns, like roses, for example, uh, it's, it's very difficult to walk through something that's thorny. So it's, it's, uh, it's, it's really, it can get you hurt. Or it can be hurtful to everyone. Uh, it's just not an easy situation. Number four is trade-off. Uh, a trade-off is basically, uh, this is more of a maybe economic term. Or finance, uh, yeah, maybe more of a, a economic or business term, but basically a trade-off is, um, you know, you uh, now you can say that it's like two people trading this for that, but in economic terms, a trade-off refers to, um, you know, when when one person or one company or one country uh, focuses or specializes on one thing, uh, and another country specializes on something else. That the trade-off is that they, they both have uh, better uh, output and better uh, opportunities for themselves. And that they, because they specialize, then it, it makes things uh, more efficient and cheaper sometimes. Uh, number five, integral. Uh, integral is another way to say that something is integrated. Um, so uh, that it's, it's part of a whole. Uh, to, to complete something. Uh, so you can say that, uh, for example, uh, <clears throat> a lot of people are complaining that fake news is uh, integral with the uh, results of the elections last year. Number six, discern, is to uh, perceive something. Uh, if you can discern the difference, sometimes, actually a lot of times we say discern the difference between something. Meaning if you can, uh, if you can understand uh, the differences between two things or if you can compare things uh, very well. And that is our uh, vocabulary.